Hello, you are welcome. How to solve for x in this nice exponential equation? We have 5 raised to power x plus 25 raised to power x equals to 125. Here, let's divide 2 by 125 raised to power x. So this becomes 5 raised to power x divided by 125 raised to power x then plus here as well we have 25 raised to power x then divided by 125 raised to power x and is equals to 125 raised to power x over 125 raised to power x so from here this cancel out and uh, we have one less here then what we have on this side from the law of indices that is when we have a raised to power n over b raised to power n so we can write it as a over b all raised to power n so when we apply this here now from here this will give us 5 over 125 all raised to power x then plus here we give us 25 over 125 all raised to power x now and uh, is equals to 1 less on this side then in the next step we have uh, 5 can go here 1 5 go here 25 so this will mean 1 over 25 raised to power x and plus also 25 can go here 1 25 go here 5 so we have 1 over 5 raised to power x here which is equal to 1 then also we can express 25 as 5 square and also 1 as 1 square that's also you know 1 and what we have here can now be written as 1 over 5 all square then which is raised to power x then plus here we have 1 over 5 raised to power x equals to 1 then from here on the law of the uh, indices we can interchange this power and this will give us 1 over 5 raised to power x and uh, which is raised to power 2 then plus here we have 1 over 5 raised to power x which is equals to 1 and here we have 1 over 5 common so let a letter represent that so let u be equals to 1 over 5 or raised to power x and here this will become in term of u we have u squared plus u then equals to 1 then we can take this one here to form the quadratic equation and we have u square plus u minus 1 equals to 0 and if we solve this using quadratic formula that this u equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a here where a is equals to 1 that's coefficient of u squared and b is equals to 1 coefficient of u c is equals to minus 1 so when we substitute here u will now give us minus 1 plus or minus square root of here we have 1 square minus 4 times 1 times minus 1 then all over 2 times 1 and from here this gives us u equals to minus 1 plus or minus square root of here 1 square is 1 then minus times minus that's plus 1 times 1 that's 4 then over 2 then which still give us 2 equals to minus 1 plus or minus root 5 over 2 and here we have two possible cases of u so the first we have u equals to minus 1 plus root 5 over 
equal to or we have u equals to minus 1 minus root 5 over 2. Then we should recall that we represented u as 1 over 5 raised to the power x. So since u equals to 1 over 5 raised to the power x, that means we can equate this now. And uh, we have on this side we have 1 over 5 raised to the power x, then equals to minus 1 plus root 5 over 2. So, and uh, from here, this will be a positive number. Also, this will be a positive number. So, we can continue with it. Now, on this side as well, we have 1 over 5 raised to the power x, which is u, equals to minus 1 minus root 5 over 2. So, this side we have positive here, and uh, we have negative here. And here, this is not possible here, so we reject this side. Then, when we work with this, we can take the log on both sides here. Then we have log of 1 over 5 raised to the power x. Then equals to log minus 1, you know, plus root 5, which we can write as root 5 minus 1 now. Then <coughs> over 2 x. So this is over 2 here. So log root 5 minus 1 over 2 from here. Then from the law of logarithm, this power here, we take it now. We have x now log 1 over 5. Then which is equal to log root 5 minus 1. Over 2 from here, we can divide both sides by log 1 over 5. So we have log 1 over 5, we divide that and also divide by log 1 over 5. Then here, this cancel out and we are left with x, which is equal to log root 5 minus 1 over 2 then over log 1 over 5 from here then this is what we have here we decide to put our answer in decimal from here then this will become x equals to log here the decimal number for this will be log 0. Point 618 from calculator that is we have root 5 minus 1 over 2 then divide by log 1 over 5 that's log 0 0.2 and uh, when we find this we divide so we have x to be equals to 0 0.299 from here then this we get the value of x on this problem to check if this satisfies the given problem we can substitute from what is given. What is given, we have 5 raised to the power x plus 25 raised to the power x equals to 125 raised to the power x. So when we substitute the value of x that we got, so we have 5 raised to the power 0 0.299 plus 25 raised to the power 0 0.299 is it equals to 125 raised to the power 0 0.299 then from there 5 raised to the power 0 0.299 will give us 1.618 then plus 25 raised to the power 0 0.299 that gives us 2.618 from calculator and uh, is it equals to 25 raised to the power 0 0.299 give us 4.236 and when we add this together from here it also gives us 4.236 which is equal to 4.236 and the uh, left hand side equals to right hand side and we can conclude from here that x 
equals to 0.299 times the size is given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos. Turn the notification bell and share this video. Give me a thumbs up. Please comment in the comment section. See you next lesson. Bye for now.